Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nock. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to play The Buttons of Destiny by ESPF. Uh, this was recommended to me on my Discord, I believe. Guys, if you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe, but let's read the description. It is said in the legends of long ago that there were three buttons. Each led to a test. A test which led to the exit. A brave adventurer on completing one of these challenges was allowed to go on his way with glory ringing in his or her ears. Only the foolish would be forced by the gods of Portal 2 to do all three challenges in all three rooms. Like you. Do them all. Now. Alrighty then. Let's jump into the map. Uh, I think it was possibly Wild Drew that uh, suggested this one to me. I know this... Uh, I know Wild Drew did a collaboration with this one. I can hear a cube bouncing. Okay, I see three nodes. What's behind door number one? Let's go behind door number one first, shall we? We have some bounce gel. Hmm. Okay. So... Okay, so I guess the first aim there was just to get the bounce shell here, so we can go back up, right? And I guess pushing the button has enabled that. Alright, let's have a look behind door number two. Okay, it seems like that is on a timer then. Yeah, there's a lot of things, there's things on timers here which I'm not uh, a big fan of. Also, not entirely sure here. What I'm meant to go or what I'm meant to do. I think that's just the cube, right? I guess I need to do this and then. Okay. So do all that. What's all this stuff down here? Is that like the? I guess that's like another test or something. I oh, know. I'm confused. Whatever I did, it turned that on. So that's progress, right? That panel looks suspicious. Okay. Uh, 
Uh, is that it? Are we done? I think we might be done. Okay, so. Some constructive feedback. It was very much walking around pushing buttons, as LB would say. Um, that has no purpose whatsoever other than to annoy the player with its sound. I know for a fact because I have included that in my match before and had similar sort of comments. But there wasn't really anything puzzling or challenging about the map, unfortunately. What I didn't like was there was a lack of signage. There is a complete lack of signage which um, confuses the player. Um, so, yeah. And the fact that things are on timers, but there's no times. Because you've turned the signage off, uh, the timers don't show. So the player doesn't know that they're against the time initially. Which, um, again, to me, was frustrating. I do like the idea, though, of this room where it's kind of like looking down into the next test. So, um, and, you know, it kind of works pretty well with that. So, well done on that. But the rest of it, I wasn't so much a fan of because there wasn't really much of a puzzle there at all. But guys, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any matches you'd like me to play, please leave them down below in the comments or head over to my Discord. Find links to that in the description where you'll find my map suggestions channel. But until next time, I've been Nock, you've been awesome. Happy gaming.